<sighs> what a long day. <laughs> Looks like someone's having a worse day than I am. <laughs> oh, I guess I better help them. Hey. Um, you mind explaining to me uh, what's going on here? Really? Because to me, it looks like you're being, you know, a bit rude. Mm hmm. I see. So, let me. Do you know who I am? Do you understand what you're doing by acting the way that you are? Because to me, it doesn't really seem like you do. Oh, <laughs> just some punk kid, huh? Okay, okay. So it's very clear you have no idea. Who you're talking to? <sighs> Idiots. Okay. Well. Do you know your neighboring... Your neighboring village? Mm-hmm. You know, the one that's much stronger than... Much larger than yours. Well, do you know how every village has like a head to the village, right? Am I explaining this in simple enough terms for you? Are you following along so far? You, in your village, you have a nice orc war chief, right? Lovely person. Good friends with them, actually. I'm actually just leaving dinner with them. <laughs> yes. So, thank him, but for that neighboring village that I was just talking about. That's, that's me. Mm. See, that's interesting, because I've heard a lot of similar things about your war chief. People kind of think that he's unfit. But, uh, he stands firm, right where he is. It's the craziest thing, isn't it? As much as he's challenged in this smaller village, still a very large village, mind you, but how much do you think I'm challenged in a much, much larger village? Mmm, good, good. I see you're the smart one of the bunch. Yes, a lot more. <laughs> oh, I've been called much worse by much smarter. So I suggest you run along. I have no interest in dealing with you. Is that a bit of shake in your voice? Is this all starting to set in? Mm. Go. Hey there, little one.
Yeah, okay. Mm. Whoa, easy, easy. <laughs> no, hey, no, you're okay. You don't have to apologize. I promise you it's okay, little one. I'm not some big royalty person. I'm not fancy by any means. I still believe in the time old tradition of being out with the people like man, so I'm not dressed in fancy clothes or anything. You're okay. <laughs> Plus, it's just dirt. It'll come out, okay? <laughs> come on. Let's go. We're going back to the village. Based on your scent, little one, you belong to my village. Mm. Yes, I can tell. Each village can has their own distinct scent. And yours bears the scent of mine. The outskirts, by my understanding. There we go. I'm just gonna carry you. What were they doing this for out? Mm -hmm. mm. What were you doing out here? Is a better question. They were traveling in Paris. You were alone. Why is that? I see. <laughs> no, little one, we're not stopping at your house. What you need is proper attention and a good meal. Both of which I have. Oh. Or at least I have the ability to give you. <laughs> Why are you on the outskirts, little one? Well, because most people on the outskirts aren't the most honest of people. Yet you seem completely honest. So, I'll ask again. Why are you on the outskirts? <sighs> I'm sorry. <laughs> You're kidding, right? Wow. Good to know. Well, that's going to change from now on. You're staying with me. <sighs> 
Yes, I mean it, little one. <laughs> Stop. You're not a monster, okay? You're not ugly either. You are very adorable. And you're honest. Which is a rare quality. I do hope you'll keep that one. Let me wrap that leg of yours. Looks like you caught it on some shrubs. It's okay. It's not gonna sting at all. I promise. <laughs> I've done this quite a few times, little one. <laughs> I guess so. There. <sighs> You're okay. Hey. You're okay. And what? A little kiss on the forehead. It seemed to have calmed me down, so I'd say it worked. It always worked for me, anyway. Mm. Here. The bathroom's that way, okay? Go get cleaned up. By the time you're done, we will have dinner. I will then change the bandages on your leg. And then... You can tell me more... About, um... About you. And then I can explain to you... How that all changes today. Yeah, oh, please. You're not the first person I've helped. However, you are the first one that I've brought into my own home, so. That ought to say something about you. Go get cleaned up. I'll get started on dinner. Yes, I cook dinner. Again, the one I said I'm not royal. Well, I don't act like it. I'm not willing to ask people to do things if I'm not willing to do them myself. And if I can do them myself, what's the point in asking somebody else to? <laughs> we cleaned up. We're having stew. It's a bit of a colder night this evening. <laughs> Go. I'll be here when you get back. You're welcome, little one. <sighs> How curious. I'll have to talk to that at work about that. Uh, those two miscreants. I think some community service will do them good. Mm. Specifically, the kind that involves being kind to others and, you know, being helpful. <laughs> 
<laughs> All the plans I would have for them. I'm sure he'll agree. 